Like, what yeah. the fuck? Yeah, like, what the fuck? Do white lives matter? Here goes, oh. they're asking people, do white lives matter? No. <laughs> do white lives matter? White lives? Um, it's a bit wow. of a tricky question. Um, Think about it. This white woman says that's a that's tricky question. That's not surprising to me, though, Bitch. at all that she would say that. It's a tricky question. <laughs> that's how brainwashed Dumb. white people are. Exactly. Yeah, that, right, she it's knows embarrassing. If, she knows if she speaks her mind, she's gonna get canceled. Yeah, maybe not though. No, maybe I mean, not. I don't think you. I don't think you get canceled for saying white. Yes, white lives matter if asked. Now, just right. proclaiming yeah. it, just proclaiming it. Yeah, but if, right, you, right. if someone asks you, you say, uh, yeah, my life kind of sort of matters." Right. <laughs> I would say right. all right. life matters, not just all lives matter. Says so all life matters. Yeah, but I don't all agree lives. with that either, though, uh, John Rebel. I would say no life matters. Matter. I, I would say no lives matter. Matter. Right, and I would agree with that more. <laughs> all lives no do not lives matter. matter. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, all lives <laughs> do not matter. Yeah, this is yeah, this is this is <laughs> this is this is this is this is just strange, man. Like this white woman, and this is a white woman that can't walk. She can't go jogging at certain times of the night. She can't mm. get on the fucking train. This is the New York subway, oh, yeah. so she she uh, I could come up and if she, like say she wasn't with this guy, right? Even if she was with that guy, somebody will <laughs> fuck him up. Thanks, thanks. Somebody will fuck his bitch ass up. He looked like the type that won't fight back. I ain't gonna lie. I could come up and I mean sock her in her chin, like I mean like sock her and throw her onto the tracks, and no one would do a thing. Bam. And and this is the this is the daughter of the founding father. She's the daughter of the people who built this country. Yeah. And she, it's and sad she, to think about it, man. And she can't even say my life matters. Uh, it's a bit of a tricky question. Um, no, not in the slightest. Yes. Oh my god. Yeah, sisters ain't sisters. Don't sisters, sisters, sisters ain't playing. They hate white people. <laughs> yeah, they really do. Sisters, I think I think the average the average white person doesn't understand that. Son men, we love y'all women. Oh yeah. We, we might be jealous of, of white men, but we love y'all women. Sisters hate all white people. They just hate white Yeah. Men. They despise it. They because, jealous, right? No, well here it's a lot of things. Okay, so so they're the mothers. That they're hair, the Lord. They're, the hair is the part, but take, <laughs> aside from the hair, you have they're the mothers, they're the ones that are going to, um, you know, birth the, these children into a world that they're told they have to work twice as hard. Mm -hmm. Think about think about being pregnant with a kid, and your mother told you that this kid will have to work twice as hard to get half as far. And then they're bullshit. talking about the mortality rate um, with like black women who are giving birth and shit like that. But um, yeah, it's know, just, I already I already debunked that though. Yeah, I mean, listen, man, preeclampsia and shit. My wife had preeclampsia with, with my daughter. Preeclampsia is like a black thing. It's like a um, it's just a black. It's, it's more susceptible to black people. Yeah. But anyway, but anyway, but what I'm saying is like they're the mothers of the kids that the prison pipeline. There's a when you send your kid to school, it's a pipeline sending <laughs> them straight to prison. And, they, mm. and if you're a mom, if you're a future mom or you're a mom and you hear this shit, that has an effect on you. For sure. You're sending, I, the white, white woman send her kid to public school and get an education. I send my kid to public school and it's a pipeline straight to prison. White woman tell her kids just work hard. I got to tell my kids work twice as hard to get fat, half as far. They hate America. They hate whiteness. They hate everything. They just Buys white people. Um, no, not in the slightest. Yes, they tried to censor the truth. No, why not? Black lives matter. I really don't give a fuck about that nigga white had a lives. Mask We're on. Get... I really don't give don't a fuck. Give a fuck. Like these sisters. And this bitch probably has a white friend. Oh yeah. Oh, I went to anybody, all her friends are white. Anybody know or Malcolm Indian. X? Malcolm X Park in DC. I was there today. I went to a couple of events today. Halloween events with, with my daughter. Um, white people. These are white events, though. I went to a couple of white events. Um, 
Malcolm X Park, big old park in DC, not like Central Park or anything, but just like a football field, like the side of a football field, right? Mm-hmm. Um, and white people sitting in groups, um, just chilling. Um, some were playing like um, uh, um, what's that game? Um, um, when you the chairs, um, you you get up and the music plays with musical chairs. Musical chairs. But, but, but they weren't playing with any chairs. They were just sitting down. Some were like laying on a blanket reading. Others were just having picnics, and it was just like little twenty little thirty little groups on this big um, park the size of a football field. And it was so calm, and there was benches all around, so all the benches that people on it. And it was probably 98% white. And the only black people you saw were some sisters, but they were sitting alone. You would see a sister like sitting alone on a blanket by herself, here reading a book, or a sister over there on her, on her laptop. It was a very comfortable, quiet event. Um, quiet, I mean, not an event, but quiet um, thing. Quiet, like just, it was so quiet. like. I said something to my wife, and my wife was like, you know, you're louder than you think. And I was like, damn, yeah. I felt <laughs> like, because, you know, I'm a some man voice and shit. <laughs> and, and then, but then we came for the drum circle, and the drum circle was all the way at the end of the park. Um, and that was, you know, the black people and, you know, the white levels and whatnot, whatever. And there were people juggling in the park, practicing juggling. It was these guys practicing, these different little street performers practicing. It was just a cool metal without vibe. The smell of marijuana wasn't in the air, overpowering. It was, you could faintly, faintly, faintly smell marijuana, but it wasn't overpowering. Um, there wasn't trash everywhere. Um, no teens eyeballing. Oh, no. Everyone spoke because, you know, you got a kid, everybody was like, oh, she's so cute. And I was just thinking, like, there's no way this could happen to some people. I mean, 20, 30 different groups. These were people that all knew each other. These were just pe- white people that come to this park, Malcolm X Park, every you no know, weekend and just hang out. This is a big place. There weren't, there wasn't, it was a lot of dogs there. No, no dog shit anywhere. It's like the dog shit just disappears because, you know, they pick their shit up with those blue bags and shit. So no dog shit anywhere. And I was just like, damn. And there was a couple of sisters there. And I was like, damn, I know these sisters. These sisters, why are these sisters here at a 98% white place? But those sisters, it was sisters there alone. And you saw some interracial couples and whatnot, but the interracial couples were just like, it it, it wasn't like like interracial mud shark couples. It was like couples where it looked like they both got good jobs and shit. but yeah, I, I just seeing that thing, and it would be a sister like this down there instead of in the hood at the hood park, and then get on TV and say this shit. Like this sister right here, she probably don't go to the fucking hood. She don't strike me as no hood booger. She strike me as a as a type of chick that hang around with white people. I the one really who said don't not at give all. a fuck about white. This one right here. Yeah. Oh, she's like Indian ish or something. Yeah, something. Yeah, but she still got sister in her. You can tell she got sister. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really don't give a fuck about white lives. We're gonna get really political. I don't want to go there. All lives matter. It's just oh no, 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 no. <laughs> See, sister, sister got mad when he said all lives. And then matter. he gotta say, oh no, 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 he's a fucking bitch. Yeah, no, he, he listen. He is a bitch. Look at him. But he's a yeah, gay he friend. Is. That's her gay friend. But here's the yeah. thing. He said the look, right thing. Good look job. Look at all the sisters' reactions. Like, it's not like, this is a good sample size, man. Look at the sisters' reactions, man. They despise white people. Do white lives matter? White lives? Um, it's a bit of a tricky question. Um, No, not in the slightest. Yes, they tried to censor the truth. No, why not? Black lives matter. I really don't give a fuck about white lives. We're going to get really political. I don't want to go there. All lives matter. No, 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 no. All lives matter. I'm glad that brother put that out there because he started a whole bunch of concert conversation. Man, you're hard to talk to. Really? Why? Because you're making me think that all my answers are wrong. And look at all the white women. All the white women are just, what's a female word for cuck? 
Is there a female workforce? <laughs> <laughs> look at it. It's just it's look at how it's specifically like women in general that can't give the correct answer. They always give the programmed yeah. answer. That's he true. needs to ask a white well, male. Except, straight except white the male. sisters. Except well, for the sisters, they were very blunt. You get that experiment you saw on there a little while back with the uh, doctor's office, the, the stand at, at every bell thing. White women would be fully on board with that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, definitely. They're conformists, man. They know that their community is hate white people, so they hate white people. This and is why it's really dangerous for them to vote. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. I feel really bad for the white people. <laughs> Yeah, these these sisters despise what. And here's the thing: most sisters, because of their community, you know, because of their state of you know child rearing, which is usually single mother, and the impoverished, and the lack of you know finances in the community, most of them get the majority of their stuff from white people. Well, the government. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, their, was... their whole standard of living is what it is because of white men paying taxes. They would <laughs> right. never have experienced any of it. Like a subway, they wouldn't even know what the fuck a subway was if it wasn't for us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. Definitely, man. Um...